And it's I've so always scary. believed, genuinely, I've always believed that Kitana is the most underrated character in the game right now. She has many, many strengths, but not the kind of playstyle that everyone can enforce to the highest effect. And Faisal it's definitely cheap. one this of them. This team is cheap, but it looks like Sonic Fox is going with the Johnny Cage. Now, Fox has been saying quite a lot going into Final Combat to expect a lot of the Johnny Chameleon. So we're seeing it for the first time here, but uh, let's get it. Let's not forget the Johnny Cage Chameleon. This was the team that Nicolas used to win Combo Breaker and defeated Sonic Fox with this very team. So a little bit of inspiration there, perhaps. Who knows? I know Fox was one of the early Chameleon believers back when the cameo first released. Now, there's the armored reversal immediately. Doesn't quite get the pickup. The fan lift unlocks a lot, actually. Who knew the Katana assist helps Katana a lot? Big we'll, surprise we'll there. We'll be seeing a lot of this if Faisal plays this team quite a lot today. Because uh, this team, I know we, we see a lot of Chameleon in general, but trust me when I say this opens up tons of options for Katana. Big damage, combo paths you never normally get. Scary, neutral, guaranteed throw scenarios. Oh, so the, much more. The Johnny Cage is going to be a matchup that Faisal is extremely familiar with. Extremely common character in the European online world. No doubt played against Kanemani constantly. And other Johnny Cages, of course. There's that combo break. Sonic Fox down on life, but with Fatal Blow and Chameleon almost fully locked and loaded. Ooh. There we go. Johnny Cage jump three. Hard to anti it. But Faisal going for a down two anti -air instead of the standing two, which is normally the far superior anti -air for Katana. Katana isn't available, so no combo off that throw. But we are entering chip damage territory. Oh my goodness, that caught a shadow kick. Stabbed him on the bottom of his expensive shoes. Sorry, Johnny. But a good round for Faisal. We already saw three armored attempts there, because when you've got that katana behind, true armored launch, and there's confirm. Oh no, another drop Faisal. There was a head shake there from Faisal. I'm not sure that fan lift was intentional, or if it was, it was just sadly mistimed. The advance, there's the knowledge. Now that airborne fan getting interrupted, that's a common thing with characters with advancing buttons and Fox wise to it now. Oh, big plus frames. Oh, the counter hit on the glaive too. You've seen how crucial combo execution can be. This all starting off the back of a unfortunate error from facial combat. Sorry, Fox. Another armored opportunity. Combo from Melina as well. That's two out of the three disguises. Give armored launch. For the Katana. low! You surely have to combo break. That would have been fatal blow into GG's Fox. The last lifeline. Oh my goodness. That was cheeky. Oh! Down one. <laughs> if Sonic Fox picked up off of that kick into Glaive, that would have been crazy. I have never seen that exchange before. Wow. Starting off strong with a shadow kick. There was no fan lift to make that safe. That was a pure read. Chase down. down. Not a huge punish, but they will add up. Immediately anti aired so now backs off instead. A little bit safer interruption. Molina is going to extend this now. Katana. Decent damage and a knockdown. Range advantage. The close range wind bomb. A little bit of a zoning tool. You have to watch out going for armored shadow kicks through it because if Faisal throws oh -ho! it behind, it's going to be good damage. Oh, missed the combo again. Faisal's execution. Now, this is a tricky team to play for sure, but we're seeing how much would you leave on the table when it comes to combo drops, especially for a team like this. So crucial. Sonic Fox. Things things up here, keeps the corner. Wake up button, the fan left to escape. There's uh -oh. the airborne fan. Chase down once again. That shadow kick has been such a good tool for that fan lift. The counter hit. Face will try to press buttons. Now we are entering last breath territory. Interruption and game one. Now we've actually gone straight into character select. So I wonder what the choice is going to be. Face will plays Katana, but also plays Peacemaker. Katana, chameleon. Go no, going, going, back back in, in. No, going back in with the team again, but for me, th oh, this looks like more outfit? of just build, you know, like building some time, favor. taking a bit of a moment. Because uh, Faisal has played a tremendous amount of this team, it, but it is a very hard team to play at a high level execution-wise. And Faisal getting a lot of opportunities here, but missing the execution. Yep. And just the damage, the, the knockdown situation after it. Well, we saw so it in the, uh, the introduction video for Group A. Faisal himself mentioned that he's pretty nervous going into this. Faisal, he is a high-level player, top level, but he has never been in this kind of situation, an invited final scenario. It's totally new to it. The escape, the fan lift, does let you escape those combos and those hits. If the opponent attacks, you get hit, but the fan lift is active, it does interrupt. Johnny Cage has a projectile of his own. There's oh, wow, the glaive. Okay. So much to look for in the neutral against Katana Chameleon. So many projectiles to be prepared for. 
And one thing you'll notice, Fox almost never spends meter on combos because the combo breaker is so much more important in this game. But also armor as well, like being able to react with armor. Letting the whole thing go here. Ooh. Back to back down one. There's the Ooh, big jump kick combo. Have to break that one now. Now fully locked. Chameleon! Oh, where are you going? The oh, trigger no, miss! Did that miss because of the way that Katana lifted her out of there? Yep, it was 2-1-2 two, two into roll, into fan lift, into I don't know what combo this is. A strange exchange, but Faisal coming off on the better side of it. Another drop from Sonic Fox. Some of these fan lift combos can be a little bit tricky. I mean, the pros make it look easy because they do it so many times, but especially someone like Katana, for example. I really love tight. the positioning from Faisal. Even though Faisal is getting chased down with a number of these shadow kicks, it's still preferable to the full combos you eat otherwise, and Fox forced to break again. Shadow kick! Oh, the counter hit! Yep, beat that landing recovery. We've got some damage coming in here. No, another drop from Faisal. Has to spend... Yeah, has to lose the positioning and spend meter just to not get punished. Faisal is having a real issue with execution, but he's going to know it better than anyone else. Problem is, I mean, you're against Sonic Fox, right? you got to play that A game or you're in trouble. Whip punish! Unusual there. The yeah, fan lift. Not to sound like a broken record, but we really are seeing it. The more it happens, the more this execution is being a problem. But if Faisal can win this game on the back of these errors, that is going to be a real kind of like breath of fresh air, right? Like, okay, well, making those mistakes, but can still get the win. On the flip side, making those mistakes and losing games you otherwise should have won. Oh, it's a hard pill to swallow. Absolutely. Especially with how many of those hits that would have resulted in so much damage. Katana Chameleon, especially in the corner, for example, hits like a truck. Now, here we go. Armored reversal. 230 damage, that not too damage shabby. Wake up interrupts. The grab is just going to completely whip there, and Sonic Fox taking full advantage of the situation. The return. Oh, combo on the way back. Decent pickup from Faisal. Respectable damage. Yeah, reaction. Yeah, those wind bombs. You're not really going to get away with those as Johnny Cage. Shadow kick far too quick. The respect. Fatal does not want to be the one to initiate first. That reaction, lightning fast. Too it far away. Reach. No, but neither did that. The reversal again, but a bit too weird. Weird jump kick that. Weird jump kick that. It has been spaghetti. All over the floor. Oh, but again, I, I really do not want to repeat myself over and over again, but it can, it is the thorn in the side that just will not be removed. So many of these instances, Faisal is in a, a, a round or straight up game winning situation and just cannot close it out. But Faisal will know that. You know, Faisal will be the, the first player to be aware of that, but easier said than done dealing with it in the heat of the moment. Problem is, we are round robin. Everyone fights everyone, right? So those wins, every single one counts. The losses, they count too. And if you're losing matches due to execution alone, frustrating way for things to unfold the later this group goes on. There's the 1-1. One, one. We'll confirm that though, because with Melina ready, Sonic Fox just cashing out, taking the damage. Try to whiff punish there, just a little bit too far away. Another reaction, no glaive oh allowed. My goodness. I've seen more shadow kicks from Sonic Fox in this set than uh, many players have thrown in the entirety of this game. But it's such a good tool. That instant reaction move, it goes so far, so fast. Another one. Yep. Hype has activated the read immediately, though, from Faisal. Katana combos, they take quite a while. And it's going to waste almost the entirety of Hype mode just from one. Again! And again! Fool me once, fool me twice, etc. <laughs> you can't see the player cams right now, but I can. Both players laughed the moment that second shadow kick whiffed. However, Sonic Fox looking to make a comeback here. We are going to spend a little bit more of that chameleon for extra damage. The escape attempt is right from Faisal, throwing you right back into the corner, however, and this comeback just became, wow! That was so bold. Uh-oh, hang it's, on. It's the fact that every one of these shadow kicks is connecting as well, that just keeps you feeling like, what can you do about it? Oh, the glaives too. Again! And another one. Oh! oh! And that's a classic MK1 finish right there. Finish match with an uppercut. And a 3-0 for Sonic Fox. Once for Tekken Master and now for Fox as well.